All right, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Buzio Duet 64 ounce insulated water bottle. I want to take a just a quick moment and thank all the folks over at Buzio for the collaboration. Um, they've been great to work with. They let me go onto their website and pick out the exact product that I wanted to review. So I'm super excited about the review. Um, it's something that I'll use in my everyday life. So I was really happy when they reached out to me. Um, that said, I hope you find the review informative. If you want to take a look at this product or any of their other products, there's a link down in the description below. And uh, make sure that you use MF Productions at checkout for an additional 10% off. Um, okay, let's go ahead and start with an unboxing. We'll do a quick test, come back for uh, a look at the overall features and functions, and then wrap up with some final thoughts. All right, so we are back for the unboxing. Um, again, this is the... Uh, the duet model um they call it duet because there's two different tops that you get with it and we'll go over those and they do have a uh, couple different models though this is a 64 ounce model and um, there's also larger models too that go up to like a gallon i believe um so we'll check all those out when we when we take a look at their website um as far as unboxing goes uh, this is the product packaging very nice clean professional product packaging um, it has some basic instructions, um, your warranty information, your cleaning and usage information, and uh, just a general warning on there. Um, as far as unboxing goes, this should be pretty simple. What we have out there? Set this on the side so you can see it a little bit better. All right, so we have the the sit top um, with a little tab that pops down. It's one of the two. Pull it out of the, the wrapping here. So there's a little lever on the top here that you just pop and it just pulls out and then pops back in place. Um, let's see what else we got in here. Basic pamphlet. Um, with their, their social information on it. Um, again, features, your warranty, cleaning usage, and a warning not to place it in like a, a microwave or the, the stove or something like that. It's not fireproof. Um, underneath that, like we have the bottle itself. All wrapped up in bubble wrap. Just peel that back. All right, so you have a couple of different straws and also a, a straw cleaner. It looks like it's already wrapped up in its case, so it comes with a, a nice little waterproof case. Shoulder strap. And this is the other bottle. So this one is the one that you can use the straws with. Um, this just comes right off and you can pop your straw in there. All right, and as far as removing the uh, the outer sleeve here, the insulated sleeve, it's pretty easy. Um, so you do have to take the top off. And this just pulls right off. I'm gonna unzip it at the bottom here. This little lip on top, pull straight up. And there you have it. All right, so we are back. We're outside uh, starting our product testing. <clears throat> um, now we've already filled this up with a uh, cold beverage. Um, so I'm going to just quickly open it up here and we will get a temperature. Just want to wait for the outside temperature to normalize a little bit so you can see what it is out here. All right, so it is about 93 degrees. All right, then the uh, liquid inside is about 40 degrees. All 
Right, so we're gonna go ahead and leave this out here in the uh, 90 degree weather for about eight hours. Um, so I'll be back with you about nine o'clock tonight when the uh, sun starts going down around here. All right. All right, so we are back and we are gonna do a quick durability test. So we just filled the bottle up and we're gonna test uh, to see what happens if it just kind of gets uh, knocked off from a, a regular height. Here we go. Looks like that's where it impacted. Maybe we can get a little sun on it and see it a little bit better. Definitely no denting. It doesn't look like it even scratched it. Got a little dirty, but that was about it. Alright folks, and we are back for the second half of the durability test. We are going to take our full bottle and basically chuck it across the yard. Alright, let's see uh, how it fares. Once again, no scratches or dents, just a little bit of dirt. Held up really well. All right, so we are back to go ahead and check the temperature. And we had to cut this a little bit short. Um, it's only about six o'clock, but it looks like it is gonna start storming here pretty soon. So I wanted to, oops. So I wanted to go ahead and get a quick test in temperature before it started pouring out here. And I think you can see that at that angle. It is still pretty hot out. It's about 85 degrees. So it looks like throughout the course of an entire day, it rose just about 10 degrees or so. I think it was about 40 before and it's 50 now. That is not bad at all. Um, that's going to do it for the testing portion, folks. Um, so I'll see you in just a minute for uh, a wrap up with some final thoughts. All right. Welcome on back. Um, so we're going to go ahead and wrap up here with some final thoughts. Um, first off, um, as far as the testing went, even though I had to cut it a little short by a couple hours, um, I was only able to test for about six hours before it started to get a, a little bit stormy and rainy out, and I had to stop. But even with that, the temperature went down only about 10 degrees, which is really good. So with that much of a, a temperature drop um, over the course of about a day, I um, wouldn't have to worry about like even ice melting in it. Um, so it worked very well. Um, and that was in pretty intensive heat and direct sunlight for the majority of the time. Um, I just wanted to quickly hop onto the website too um, and kind of highlight some of the features um, and the different products that they had while we're going through the, the kind of the wrap up that we did. Um, so the uh, Duet is the model that I showed off and there's a bunch of different models within that. So you have 22 ounce all the way up to 87 ounce. Um, so if you're looking for something that's going to fit in your car holder, 
Um, you'd have to measure first, but you're, you'd probably go with one of the uh, 40 ounces or maybe even one of the smaller 22 ounces to fit in there. Going with that, the Trophy Series actually has a tapered bottom that's specifically designed to fit in cup holders. So if you're, you're looking at that's something you're looking for, you could also check out that model as well. Um, personally, for me, I like the, the Duets in the Trio Series. Uh, Trio just has an extra top. It has the wide mouth top. So that's the difference between those two. And then the Rock Series has the extra large ones that come with the uh, paint glasses as well as all the, the other accessories as well. Um, additionally, you can purchase sleeves on their own. The standard one that I showed off in the unboxing video, um, they, they also have ones that have a, a little bit more as far as accessories go. A little pouch on the front where you can uh, uh, zip and unzip and, and hold different things. If you're going on, say, a hike opposed to uh, just trying to, to keep it a little cooler. So one of the things I wanted to point out that I found really great um, is they have a lifetime warranty on all of their water bottles, um, which I haven't really seen before um, from any of the other companies that do this. So if you want to check out details on the lifetime warranty, um, if you want to check out any of the products or accessories, just hop on over to their website. Um, there's a link in the description below. Uh, make sure when you're checking out, use MF Productions at checkout and get yourself a 10% discount. So that is going to wrap it up for me today. Um, overall, I would say um, my experience with both the company and using the product is, has been a 10 out of 10. Yeah, I hope you found this informative. If you did, and if you like the products, go ahead and check them out. Use the link in the description. Make sure to use that promo code for 10% off. That said, thanks as always, everyone, for your support. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.